Hey guys, what's up? It's Wolf here, one and only. Welcome back to some more The Alchemist Code. How are all of my adventurers doing out there? Well, two new Genesis characters came out. Not gonna summon for them. Because I have no interest in them, really. And, you know, eventually you'll get them sooner or later. <laughs> if, you know, another Genesis character comes out within that banner. And, you know, if your luck is that terrible and the character that you want is actually OP, you're, you're gonna end up getting those two. <laughs> That's how I've learned my games go. But yeah, we're going to go through normal, then see how the normal boss is, then we'll wrap up there. Uh, first things first, let's go look at enlightenments. I always like checking enlightenments. That's my main thing I love doing. Either that or job changes, but I don't think we have any job updates. Oh, Emil's going up again. Okay. So you, you can get all that from probably the new Genesis quest. Too bad I don't have any shards for her. So, yeah. <laughs> that ain't gonna work out. Eh, I'm pretty sure that's it. Yep. But, anywho. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. Get some of this crap done and then we can just chill. Then I have the Mega Dragon Blaze video, so yeah, lots of things to do. I've been enjoying Tam like way too much. Like she is <laughs> like she is so much fun. She's not leaving the party. That that's all I can tell you. She's not leaving a party until somebody else interesting I have built comes around. I have like fucking seven or eight hundred Vettel shards now. And I'm tilted. <laughs> Most people are probably just telling me to sell it. Just sell it. And I'm just sitting here like, no. <laughs> Level 97 is a thing. Then soon, you know, level 99 will be a thing. Well, not soon. In the far, 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 very far, far, extremely far future. <laughs> Turn off the auto. And let's go ahead and give... Wait, it's another one, isn't it? Yeah, it should be over here. Click in. Give you this. Wait, what? Him. Thank you. <laughs> I think I could reach this one. If I can, I could just kill that one. Hello, game. Oh, wrong one. Nah, I thought I could reach it. <laughs> Apparently not. <laughs> I 
Oh yeah, that kills you. Let's let's not do that. Oh, the whole skill thing. Did not realize that was the thing. <laughs> Usually I look at that. Apparently not today. I'll do it later. We're never in a rush to do these things. Where is that tech? No, that's not the quick cast one. This one is. Speaking of quick cast, they made Minerva like extremely insane. <laughs> Especially if you get her fully gated level 95, like <laughs> Minerva is just like something else now. Which is not necessarily a bad thing at all. No, it's definitely not. Minerva's fucking amazing now. Like, at first, she was, like, one of the more meh exclusive units next to Sig. And now it's just, like, oh, boy. <laughs> She's not fully, like, love level 95 yet her fifth gate is just like one in that's the thing once you finish level 95 you literally the the attack that hits aoe on the map is no longer a charge or no longer a cast it literally is just the instant use Okay, they don't want me to use skills again, they just want me to pick up treasures again. <laughs> oh, whoops. I was about to say, this skill is actually extremely good too. Yeah, right now that's that skill's still a cast. So we're gonna change that. And that's the last skill we're going to use. I don't have to worry about the NPC skills because the NPCs don't count towards using skills. For our challenge at least. Thankfully enough. Another reason why I don't like the Genesis quests is just because it takes forever to try and get tickets to be able to fight the boss over and over again. Especially if you don't have, like, you know, skip tickets.
So I have to literally just sit here and collect so many of these freaking tickets. And why I'm only getting like three. Three or to two maximum. Sometimes even one. Inside of a run. Alright, what are we doing here? Okay, just max items now. We can use skills now. Nice. Nice, dude. Nice. And a skip. I say I don't know what it is with the Alchemist code, but sometimes I get like extremely tired when playing it. <laughs> But most other games that literally, <laughs> that literally, um, how do I say it? I say most other games that have auto retry, I don't really get tired of just because I can literally just sit there and relax. <laughs> so I really don't have to worry about too much on that. I already heard that a lot of other people are already figured out a way to auto retry for themselves. Right, I've been wanting to see how much damage that charge does for this. Nah, not too much. But then again, it is defense and ore. How much would you want Deepus in order to scale up of? <clears throat> Plus, people also use. People don't really use um, that charge up skill for Minerva. They used the one from, um, what the heck was it? Oh, thank god I did that. So that I can hit them. Okay, never mind, they have the dodge rate of a god. What was I talking about? <laughs> I get distracted so easily. Oh yeah, the charge up. They use the charge up from that um, other job she has, basic job. trying to see how effective that was on my own units. <laughs> I'm pretty sure it's still not safe on allies. Ah, uh, that makes Minerva really good when fighting the raddies too. The metal raddies.
where the whole uh, job enhance quest. Wait, why am I trying to take an ally? <laughs> Alright, we're no longer on the skill BS, it's just no items. Well, less items. I like that a lot more. Like, don't limit my skills, dude. Please. <laughs> Plez. Pretty sure they also scaled up Minerva's uh, shield when you got the whole job plus. I say we gotta kind of take it slow. We don't try. We don't want to. Like kill every single thing right away. We get all these chests, but I'm sure things will will spawn in a few seconds after two kills. Yeah. We're gonna at least half them. Ah, huh, why not? Still a good chunk though. I was gonna have the NPCs deal with that. how insane that character is. Let's overclock ourselves so we can get over here a little bit faster. That also works in my favor sometimes too. Alright, alright. I'm happy to have Minerva back in my team now. I say it's been a while. Happy that her heal is no longer like really risky to use. Cause it's it's always been like extremely good. Just cause it didn't have like a like a in, it didn't have like a cast time to it, but the thing is, it was, it was really unsafe because sometimes you can be very unlucky and get death status on your characters, and that's the worst thing you could possibly get. But now that they took off the whole status thing; it's way better. I <laughs> say, so if you guys haven't gotten Minerva Job Plus, uh, the next time it comes by, I would recommend highly getting it. If it's not gone already, I'm pretty sure it's still up. Okay, what was, uh, this? Oh, this is pretty straightforward. I guess we gotta go all the way around, huh? I was trying to see something on this. Okay, so now even defense nor these guys just got a lot of HP, basically. <laughs> I was about to say, who the hell wants to actually sit there and just? Just doing that, try <laughs> try to get through all that. I was like, if it was like a quest or something, I definitely would.
Wait a minute, also. Okay, so we don't have to collect items on this, it's just basically kill. Hmm. Those poor soldiers, they just got hit in the face. Damn, dude, do they even really need me? That's the real question. <laughs> Seems like they got it all down. I don't think they need me, buddy. <laughs> At least weaken them for you guys. It's like I'm gonna take a kill from you. I'm gonna weaken her again. Just kill her forehead. This is actually a really nice map. With a little desk there. <laughs> Happy to see those that are making a lot more maps. Maybe a weird smaller map, but eh, looks pretty nice. Well, I should be say translating more maps. Nah, it would be more of sending over more maps. <laughs> from the Japanese server. Alright, so what's this stage going to be on? Okay. <laughs> Let's see. Huh. Oh, never mind. It's the same room. <laughs> Except for we're on the other side now. Haha. <laughs> Reverse. <laughs> oh, damn. Not in a straight line. Let's do this then. I'll say that should give us two kit. Nope. They're, they're weirdly placed from each other. God damn it. Uh, just do this. Well, yeah. Screw it. <laughs> I'd say maybe this will just open up other enemies. <laughs> wait, is there another enemy on this? Oh, okay, there, there they are. I was like, wait a minute, what? <laughs> okay, so some other things are definitely going to be spawning here. Okay, so we don't need the chest. that quest <laughs> I 
pick up stuff. Say, geez, dude, she has a lot of movement for an archer. You just get halfway across the map, just, just within seconds. I like it. Plus, it's been a while since we had like another really good archer. I have an idea. We haven't even tried jewel destruction or charge at all. <laughs> is it I'm pretty sure jewel destruction is based off of magic? So I totally want to try something. Magic boost on her. Slaughter six. Oh, I didn't even see this thing in the fucking background. What the fuck is that? I was not paying attention at all. <laughs> Slaughtering six just means killing six enemies. Thankfully, it doesn't mean like. Hello? Can we turn around? Thank you. Doesn't mean killing simultaneously. Oh wow, so he doesn't count towards that. Okay, never mind then. Fuck me. So that's going to be our boss, apparently. So girl probably won't be useful for that. <laughs> probably. That looks weird and cool at the same time. <laughs> ah, to be continued, of course. You can't let go of that meme. <laughs> okay, let's go collect these. Another quest. Oh, 
Oh, what the hell? Stop that. I think I clicked it like way too far over here and it just sent me somewhere else. So what is this glove? Oh, this glove is for that character. Meh. Meh, meh, meh. I don't think there's anything over here, really. Yeah. Nothing much over here unless you guys want to do the wedding battles, I guess. <laughs> Let's go back here and fight this boss because we need to make an auto team for it. So it's mostly going to be a fire team. I can bring. Aaron for his leader. Then we can bring you. We bring Masamune. Let's also bring Dorothea as well. Then we'll put Chai in there. But if I remember correctly, they changed a lot of the stats. Oh, the ways that these bosses work instead of just like you know slowing down the boss and the, you know taking turn after turn I, I noticed they did this in the raid which is very unfortunate because they just hindered us a lot with that change instead of like oh crap I forgot to change the thing that's always annoying and I forgot you can't change it here I think I was doing a mission and I totally forgot to turn that off. Yeah, this has to go. Now, so there'd be no point if I just manual it. If I manual it, it wouldn't be much of a novelty. <laughs> Oh yeah, man, they could auto it pretty easy. Well, at least a normal one. But they did damage, like, really fast. I would just have to take out... Yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah! Maybe she could stay in. But then again, it's kind of like, meh. <laughs> I probably need to take her out because she isn't going to use the skills that I want her to use out of that situation. As much as I love love her, she has to go. But with that said, I'm going to end it off there. Hope you guys enjoyed. I'm probably going to go asleep and pass out now, but I'll see you guys on the next one. Until then, peace out. <laughs>